Hi dears! Today I'm going to be doing a unboxing video of some stuff I got at the Lolita Collective. When I went for TechoCon, I won one of the raffle prizes and it was a free petticoat and parasol, which is great because even though I've been in like Lolita fashion for like three years, I have never purchased a parasol except for like, I got one on Taobao that's just like a foldable one that's really small. It's not really Lolita. It's got a lot of ruffles on it, but it's not really like a baby parasol and AP one. I mean, this one isn't either. It's it's just like a off-brand one from Lolita Collective, but it's really cute and um, it's like a full length one and it's, I got it in navy. There was like only like navy and like a, another colorway, I think like purple left. So a navy should go with a lot of stuff. I mean, it should go with my cute little ethereal journey that I am wearing today. Something like this. My necklace too. So yeah, it should go with things like that. I do like navy a lot, so I have unicorn blue land and navy, so I was like, oh, that'll go with it. Uh, there should be somehow possibly a petticoat in here as well. If not, then I will do another video when I receive that. So the other item I got is eBay. It is a it's a My Little Pony duffel bag from the 80s. I got it for my Japan trip. It's like 20 inches by 10 inches so it's small enough to fit as like a carry-on item and it's really cute and so yay I'm excited okay so I'm gonna bust this open I don't understand where they got packaging like this but this is awesome it was really hilarious when I was taking this uh, back from the front office of my apartment on the on my bike and I had it like in the front basket and it was sticking out like like this like a unicorn horn at the front of my bike as I'm biking so I was worried you know if cars didn't see me there's no way they couldn't see me then <laughs> oh they wrapped the they wrapped the petticoat around it that's so smart oh my god Yay! <laughs> I have a real petticoat finally. I um I loaned my 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 first uh, petticoat I ever made, or my only petticoat I ever made. It was an A-line petticoat. My first, it was one of the first things I ever sewed for Lolita. Uh, I loaned it out for Momocon, and uh, it just kind of went missing afterwards. And it, it was uh, made out of like that sturdy crinoline. But that also meant that because it was made out of that, that every time I wore any kind of tights with it, the crinoline from the petticoat would just like ruin them, like scratch them up. And then I was like, wow, I need to, I need to wear bloomers. But this is Florida, so unless I'm wearing super short bloomers, it's too hot to wear like to the knee bloomers that would actually protect my tights. So now I've got a better petticoat that hopefully should be made out of soft stuff. So shouldn't, oh my goodness. Oh, okay, I got it. <laughs> All right, wow. So we got lovely parasol. They shipped this out really fast too. I ordered it on Friday. Let's see. I know you shouldn't open an umbrella indoors, but I am not superstitious. So. It is, I wanna make sure all the mechanics work. They, whoa, oh cool. There's a little button right here. And you push the little button, it looks like a little cute like jewel thing. And then it just pops open like perfectly. It is very cute. Awesome. And it's easy to close up again. Cool. Can see why they only had the two colorways left these are very cute and i would like one in black and white as well all right so that's item number one nothing else left in this box business card and a piece of paper that says congratulations on the win kim thank you for so much for your order we value your business please let us know if you have any comments or questions and it's got cute stickers on it very cute. Now for the petticoat. Uh, it is from One Day in Paradise. And I've seen these in their booth before and I thought they were very nice. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, it looks 
very cute. It's very big and poopy. Nice. I actually currently have on this cupcake petticoat that is not suited for this dress. Kind of, it kind of does that thing where it, cu it cupcakes in at the bottom. So I'm gonna just switch out these petticoats. Oh yeah, and it's orange. It is bright orange and I hate that, but it was cheap, so. All right, I'm gonna switch it out real quick. Very nice, very poofy. It's very full. So, I, yeah, I like it. This one will work well because it's kind of all around poofy, so, um, yay. Okay, so now we're gonna open the, the My Little Pony duffel bag. As you can see, my other cute pony related bags back there as well. So, all right. Okay. <clears throat> Be careful, I don't cut the actual duffel bag. So the lady who was selling it on eBay, she admitted it was a little dirty. Um, it was like 30 bucks, but you know, and I was like, mm, 30 bucks for a dirty duffel bag. But the thing is, is that I tried looking for it other places and it was all sold out everywhere. So, and it's nothing I can't probably wash. And I don't really mind if it looks a little worn because I mean, it's supposed to be from like the 80s. So, all right, so, ooh, it's cute. So it's got the little, it's got a little flutter pony on the side, on the, yeah, on the side. And then opens up. And this is, this is funny because this duffel bag is for the sleeping bags, the My Little Pony sleeping bags. And um, I have both of them. I have the one with the ribbon where it's like a pole in the middle and the ribbon wraps around and it's got all the ponies. And then I have the other one which is like, it's got Megan on it and all the other ponies just like running around Ponyland. Yeah, it needs like a bit of a wash because it's got some, some stains on it or whatever. But it's got Megan on it which is super cute. And it was free shipping, so I mean that kind of makes up for it. I love Megan. I, I actually dressed up as Megan for Halloween like last year. Well, that's nice. It has like a little side zipper right there on the. I'm holding it too close. So I can put like, I don't know, it's like a little side pocket, so I can put like all kinds of cute stuff on the side. And then it's got a front zipper. Mm. It's a little dirty there, ew. I bet you I can wash that out though. I don't understand that. I don't really understand why like people will sell things on like, you know, eBay or Etsy or something. And then they're just like, it's a little dirty. Like if you just gave it like a good bath, like, you know, or like a Goodwill. Sometimes some of the things at Goodwill, I'm just like, if you just gave this a little bath, a little TLC, you could probably sell it for a lot more because it's like, you know, you cleaned it up. Okay, so I'm gonna see inside, it's the main pocket right there. So it's it's super cute <laughs> otherwise. Oh, and then on this side, it has like a little Velcro pocket. This is not my first My Little Pony like piece either, by the way. I have the watch, I have the really little, like vinyl purse. But yeah, and I also have a, a My Little Pony wallet, which also is vinyl, so it's, I think it's, I think the button snapped out of, out of it because I used it like all the time. Because when I first got it, it was like pristine condition. It's only like, I think it was like eight bucks or something. So that is my duffel bag, my little pony duffel bag. Very cute. I really love flutter ponies. So this is like the best. So, okay. And then last but not least, after I have done my unboxing here, I'm, I'm just do a little outfit rundown. I know I've mentioned it before briefly, but this is Ethereal Journey. This is from the... My Truly Darling, my last series I've done so far this year, that was a print series. It has my own personal design print that I drew up. It's got a little crosses on the collar. This is detachable. There's the matching necklace. Um, and then there's a little, it comes with like a little tie around the middle. And, uh, and it has little, it has wings on the back as well. I don't know if you can see it really. Hold on. There. There's wings. Wings on the back of it. And it's very light. It's like a it's a light poly crepe de chine fabric with some puff sleeves. And uh, yeah, it's just very light and has this cute trim on it. 
and um, it's just like perfect for if you're like a Florida Lolita or if you're a Southern Lolita at all or if you're just somebody who really really likes this new chiffon like Lolita stuff which I really love I, I just love chiffon it's great it doesn't wrinkle I can travel with it and it just you can just pop it right out of your bag and you're ready to wear it you don't have to bring your steamer with you or anything like that so it's really great I'm also wearing like a little basic AP bow with it and a wig from a friend of mine that I bought from I don't know I think it might be a lock shop wig I'm not 100% sure but I like this wig a lot because it looks like the, my natural hair color but it's like already styled so I don't have to style my hair so it makes things a lot easier I can just throw it on thank you so much for watching my uh, unboxing video of everything and uh, yeah uh, subscribe and like and let me know if you want to see more unboxing videos so 